me, Chad. Yeah, yeah. In the West Coast and in the Guadalajara area, what what music did you? Ah, uh, well, my dad listened to a lot of I don't know Vicente Fernandez. Yeah, of course. Um, we used to listen to Bronco. So, I mean, I never like I still like have it on my playlist. Absolutely. Um, so, definitely kept the Spanish alive through them and. Uh, but then you know, when I hit my teenage years, that's when I started listening to a little bit more hip hop. Mm -hmm. Like mm -hmm. I said, like I'm a West Coast guy, so I was Snoop Dogg, of course, you know, of NWA, course. Yeah, 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 Dr. Yeah. Dre. This is a local hero, right? Yeah, uh, it's Elena. A Texas hero, you know? Yeah. There is not one place you can't not play. Like you could literally play it at any place here restaurant, club, uh, at the stadium. Yeah. And they're just going to love yeah, it. Yeah, know? absolutely. So, yeah. Yeah, I, I think this is our biggest living yeah. legend. Oh you know? my god. This guy has paved the way for all of us here in Austin, yeah. Texas. Yeah, staple you know? of the city, man. Yeah, yeah, totally. I mean, if, if you got a statue in your city, you made it, you know? Yeah, Gary Clark Jr. Yeah, He's unbelievable to me. Um, there's a lot of artists, like huge artists who are so into him right now, too. Like, yeah. when they talk about him, it's like they're talking about a young Jimi Hendrix. Uh, it's awesome to be in Austin, listening to music, fans, chants, all that. You know, I grew up with, so it's it's cool. I've been I've enjoyed my time here, and hopefully, I got a lot more years to to be, to be here. To be here, absolutely, yeah. man.